Schrodinger's remote. The following document contains conflicting versions. Item number SCP-027-J Object Class Safe! Euclid Safe! Euclid Keter Special Containment Procedures SCP-027 is to be contained on the damn couch in the proper holder that I spent like 30 goddamn dollars on designated SCP-027-J-1. SCP-027-J-1 is a cheap piece of plastic you paid too much money on and shall be designated SCP-027-J-$ at the Benson household, even though it's probably on fucking Jupiter half the time, until further notice. When SCP-027-J switches phase, Researcher Benson is to be consulted as to where the hell she left it. Researcher Benson is to calm the hell down, it's just a remote. SCP-027-J is to be placed in the proper receptacle. I swear to God, Phil, don't say a goddamned word. Description. SCP-027-J is a Roku. Cable box. Roku. Cable box. Television remote control which appears to have two quantum states. An R2787 Roku remote control, designated SCP-027-J-A for a redacted model television, which was so goddamn expensive, which was on sale and you agreed on, manufactured in 2015. A Fios 27 cable box remote, designated SCP-027-J-B, which is goddamn useless because we have Netflix, Hulu, and Amazon Prime, which is necessary because adults have cable. At no time can SCP-027-J exist in both states, because researcher Benson can't keep track of the goddamn remotes when she's watching her programs. Due to its anomalous effect of making researcher Benson a dickhead, due to its anomalous effect, SCP-027-J was first discovered when after installing the new Roku TV in the living room, when researcher Benson immediately lost the Roku remote, the Roku remote went to missing. After two weeks, the Roku remote was discovered, and the cable box remote promptly disappeared. Researcher Benson lost my remote to stop me from watching Dance Moms. SCP-027-J changed quantum states, leading to the discovery of the nature of SCP-027-J. Addendum A. On redacted. For God's sake, Jillian, stop redacting my notes. No! It was discovered that both the cable box and the Roku have smartphone apps, which can control both devices. Researcher Benson kindly installed these apps and set them up on both his and Researcher Benson's smartphones. Both applications were installed, and SCP-027-J's effect now appears to extend to Researcher Benson's phone now too, since that's either dead or missing all the time. For fuck's sake, Phil, it's not that big of a deal when I'm home. Just stop losing the goddamn remotes! research into the spread of SCP-027-J's effect, and Jillian's inability to keep track of a thousand dollar phone, it was 450, you giant crybaby, is ongoing. Dr. Lawrence note, Jesus Christ, would you two please get some counseling? <laughs>